Hi, I'm Terry Franz. This is my first Blender tutorial and I will show you today how to do 3D text in Blender and to how to save it with transparent background. Ok, this is our Blender and first let us remove this cube. Ok, now let's go to add text. Mm -hmm. This is a text and let us change it. These are different text properties characteristics and let's work with it and let us see. I want to delete this text and to tape mine. So here you see the object mode, you have to switch it to edit mode. Now you can do it. Delete and let's put something like Blender for example and switch it back to object mode. Let us rotate it a little bit like that like this. Mm -hmm. It's nice. Now I would like to move it a little bit to the left and, and pick up. So here in transforms you can see location. Let us slide it. X. Um, there are a lot of characteristics a lot of properties, a lot of sliders and you can you can slide them and to see what will happen to your text and choose what you would like to, to do with your text. Now for example I would change it for will do it like deeper. So let's find geometry and increase a little bit extrude mm -hmm. like that. I think it's nice. Now let's change the color of our text to render and click on cursor and move it to the, your text and now now choose material properties on our panel create new and choose base color by clicking on different places of this sphere you can get whatever you want. <laughs> color. I will choose the red one maybe. Ok, it's ok. And let's see what can, what else interesting is here. Uh -huh. Metallic, let's increase it a little bit. As I said by sliding, different sliders, changing different properties, you can get something interesting for you. And we can choose the font. You can change the font for example. Let's choose something like that. Mm -mm. Like that. Ok. And there are a lot of other different options but the main idea is how to do the transparent background. How do you have to render out the transparent background? So. Let's go to Render Properties and find a Film tab and click on Transparent and now you see our background is transparent. Ok, now let us save it with this transparent background. Let's go to Render. It will be like that. Save as. Choose the place for your file, choose its name and the main idea is you have to choose file type. It has to be PNG. Be sure it's PNG, it's not JPEG but in order to keep transparency it has to be PNG. And one more thing, the color has to be RGBA. Ok, that's it. Thank you for staying with me and hope to see you soon. Bye!